Hey everyone, today we are diving into how you can get that sleek Apple look on your Linux machine without sacrificing all the power and flexibility that Linux gives you. So whether you're making the jump from macOS to Linux or you just love that refined Apple aesthetic, stick around because I've got three distros that nail the macOS vibe. Well, let's check out the top three Linux distributions that let you do just that. Elementary OS often tops the list for anyone seeking a macOS-like experience on Linux. Its Pantheon desktop environment gives you that familiar dock along the bottom and a clean top panel housing system, indicators, date, and time. The interface is super intuitive, making it easy for macOS migrants or even Windows users to settle in quickly. The built-in App Center favors apps that follow Elementary's human interface guidelines so everything feels cohesive and with FlatHub integration built in, it's straightforward to install additional software beyond their curated selection. You'll also find a multitasking view reminiscent of Mission Control. While the global menu and Spotlight search aren't exactly replicated, its search is inspired by Spotlight but isn't as feature-rich, Elementary OS does deliver a streamlined layout right out of the box. Deepin is another strong contender if you want your Linux system to look like the latest Mac OS version. Originally based on Ubuntu and now built on Debian Stable, Deepin features its own desktop environment and a suite of specially designed Deepin applications that blend seamlessly for a polished Apple-esque aesthetic. However, because the Deepin servers are located in mainland China, you may notice slower load times when updating apps or browsing the App Store. If that's a concern, especially around speed or privacy, consider Ubuntu DDE, which layers the Deepin desktop environment on top of Ubuntu to avoid those slowdowns. Topping our list is Ubuntu Budgie. Out of the box, it gives you a dock at the bottom and a top panel, but the real power lies in its makeover and layouts tool. With just a few clicks, you can tweak your plank dock settings, customize hot corners, and adjust the top panel to get a desktop that looks strikingly similar to macOS. Underneath, you're running on Ubuntu, so you benefit from its stable core and massive app library via the built-in app center. Ubuntu Budgie is also more resource efficient than some other options, making it a great choice for modest hardware. Just be aware that the macOS aesthetic isn't immediately perfect. You'll need to spend a little time with the customization tools, which can have a bit of a, a learning curve. So which one should you choose if you want something that just works and looks like macOS from the moment you boot up? Elementary OS is your best bet. But if you're up for a little tinkering to get that perfect Apple vibe on a rock-solid Ubuntu base, Ubuntu Budgie is where it's at. And if you're drawn to super slick visuals and don't mind the occasional slower download, give Deepin a spin or try Ubuntu DDE for a speedier alternative. That's it for today. If you found this helpful, um, give the video a like, hit subscribe for more Linux tips, and drop a comment below telling me which distro you're excited to try. Until next time, happy computing.